not be a loaded question. Are there any rednecks here tonight? I know there are rednecks all over Florida. So I'm going to sing you a song. I left Confederate Railroad in 2010. And I signed my own record. Hey, that's a nice hat, y'all got. I signed my own recording contract and won Music Grows Independent Artist of the Year three times. Had three number one videos and a lot of really cool things happened. One of the cool things that happened for me is I went on tour with David Allen Coe. And since then, I have recorded four gospel albums. <laughs> right. <laughs> Change your life. But this song, I... Uh, I recorded and released when I was touring with David and we shot the video in like seven states. So this is for all my redneck friends that are here tonight. This is where I grew up. It's, listen to these words, it's really important. Charlie's got a backyard full of fighting roosters and a front yard full of old cars. He buys moonshine from his Uncle Elroy and one quart mason jars. And some folks believe that he grows some weeds that just might get him some time. But he ain't a bad guy, he's just a redneck friend of mine. this song before I'm sure I will ask you and everybody here if you'll do me a favor before I end this song I don't want you to make my truck payment or anything it's a real simple favor will you do me a favor somebody say amen amen I hope y'all will all be redneck friends of mine
me buy Confederate Railroad albums. And I don't know if y'all know this or not, but uh, I'll back up. 18 years ago this week, 18 years ago this week, I got a phone call while I was still in Confederate Railroad. Danny called me and he said that we were going to do 40 shows with my favorite country music singer of all time. And it was February the 12th is the best I remember. 18 years ago. And on February the 13th, we heard all over the nation that Wayne Jennings had passed away. The guy who sang Good Old Boys that you listen to every Friday night was my favorite country music singer of all times. And 18 years ago this week, he passed away. We've never played this before, but we're going to do this for all the Wayland fans, and I'm number one. God bless you. Christmas. 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 Christmas.
is long. They said rain, no rain. This is the most beautiful night. Gosh, it's beautiful out here. I hope you're having a good time. We've been looking at these vehicles, and my gosh, there's some great stuff around here. We want to thank the folks who put this show on. In fact, I have something i got to say here. Because, as you know, putting on a show takes a whole lot of time and effort, which means that whoever's doing it is not home for Valentine's Day. So, uh, for Chuck and Brian of Big Boys Toys, they wanted me to wish Adise and Cheryl a very, very happy Thanksgiving. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Thanksgiving because they were working on Thanksgiving as well. And while we're at it, Adise and Cheryl, happy birthday and Merry Christmas. Because these guys are busy. But no, thank you. They, they love you very much and they appreciate your, uh, your uh, patience with them while they were doing all this. And I know you guys have been supporting them through it. So, love you, John! Something happened on my guitar. Go. This is a new song off our record called The Odyssey. Hope you enjoy it. You like country music?
were born. Yeah. Uh, of course. Uh, as soon as I get this guitar too. Congratulations on your recovery, man. Thank you. Good. Here we go. Yeah. Been praying for you. Been to California, where the ladies look so fine. They can take a long haired country boy, softly bend his mind. They love the music, where the press him silk and pearls. Come along.
How many of y'all have ever been stuck in a relationship? It's kind of like a cold sore just kept coming back. Well, this is it. I'm, I'm not with the person you're with now. I she always spoke of going back to Texas. Uh oh, can you hear the guitar? She always spoke of going back. Oh my goodness. Hey Cody, would you? You want me to tell you a story? Why he tunes his guitar? Tunes, tunes his guitar. I'll tell you a story. That uh, how many people here are or Dukes of Hazards fans like I? Am? How many people here knew yep. that he had four or five number one records in the eighties? And I'm gonna let you in on a secret that we know. But you don't. He is a really, really genuinely good guy. And you guys don't know how much he, all the rest of us and, and John himself appreciate you guys always coming out and supporting shows around the country and being here for this sp spectacular event tonight. And uh, give it up for your host for the evening. And uh, are you tuned now? And happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> it, it, it's not Thanksgiving. But we're all giving thanks. <laughs> we should be thankful every day, so we'll say happy Thanksgiving today. Are you ready? All right, ladies and gentlemen, back to the show. So, you know who you are. This is for you. Kick it off!
course, Soundman wrote this song, and I think uh, I think you're gonna like it. Yeah. It's gonna be a single out here pretty soon. Yeah. And it's fun. It goes like this. Love it. Get your groove on, let's do it.
Yo lo voy a decir, suéltame. Pero llora esta dice. But with all of that pain, I go back again. I always go one more round. Women, me and love, we just can't get it right. I may lose a battle, but I love the fight.
song in this key of cat, right? Hey, uh, hey, hey, long, long neck, red neck, long neck, red neck.
for doing stuff like this. Let's do stone on the Okay, I'm going to put this down for a second. Here's a country song. It's right now number 36 on the charts, by the way. Doing good, doing good. 36 with a, not with an anchor, not with a bullet either, but it's, you know, 36. So 36.
thank you so much. Yeah. So proud of that song. You know, something's happened to country music. <laughs> Not sure what, what's that? Well, that's a sign of a good player. I've had those strings since 1982, and I haven't busted one yet. That's a sign of me. That's why my guitar is down there. But I think somebody has got to start singing songs about the state of country music. Not all of it, but some of it. I worked with Buck Owens, and I, I think Buck might... Touch the green, green grass of home. <laughs> All right. I'm not sure that's the grass he was singing about. <laughs> you know what a kick Roy Clark would have gotten out of the fact that marijuana is now legal in most states? He just said, what? What? <laughs> okay. We're going to do a little song. When I grew up, well, when I was getting older, because obviously I've never grown up. What? They lived it up and wrote it down. They were more than drugstore cowboys. They've been bucked and bruised and kicked around. They took their pain, their voices rang, till the whole world sang that country sound. All because they lived it up. They lived to write it down. didn't understand him when he wore his mohair suits and skinny ties. So Willie took old Trigger, said you'd kiss my Nashville ass goodbye. 
On a bloody merry morning, he was on the road again in Texas bound. He's living it up somewhere tonight, so he can write it down. I know it, they don't know it. They don't know it, it's kind of important if they know it. We're gonna do another one, what? We don't, we do that when Keith is here. Here, you're gonna learn this song right away. When a redneck with a, with a red, that's, I'm so white. When a redneck with a paycheck beats a long, no, wait, wait. Go, yeah, do that. When a redneck with a paycheck beats a long neck, it's a safe bet there's a train wreck of a party going on. When the sunlight turns to moonlight, turns to all night, turns to all right, we've been known to keep it rolling all weekend long. It's about to get all crazy up in here. Lord knows it happens every time. That a redneck with a paycheck needs a long neck. It's the same that there's a train wreck of a party going on. When the sunlight turns to moonlight, turns to all night, turns to all right. We've been known keep it rolling all weekend long. Water. 
here on Saturday night. From a page of grace and rock of ages. I was back in black and I walked back.
Well, hot and dear. 